Hey guys, I'm Phil the Blanks. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Red and Blue. Uh, we are at, well, not right now, but we are going to be at the Elite Four. But first we're getting our last Pokemon we can get before beating the game, and that is Lickitung. We needed a Slowbro specifically to uh, trade with this guy for Lickitung. And I believe that's the only Lickitung in the game. I guess you can catch them in yellow, but whatever. I'm not playing yellow right now, so I wanted to be able to show you me getting it here. So, yay, Lickitung. Lickitung is one of those Pokemon that I've never used. Um, I have no idea if this one's good or not. Or not. I noticed a lot of the, like, bigger, um, no evolution, like, Pokemon, the ones that, like, don't actually ha have an evolved state are apparently pretty good a lot of the time. So, I don't know if Lickitung is, but he's a weird looking thing. But that is it. So, we got Lickitung, which means I now have 149 Pokemon. Look at that. 149. All I'm missing is the very last one, 150. Which you cannot get, unless you're trading, um, until you've, after you've beaten the game. So, hooray. With that, let's go back to Indigo Plateau. I love how Lickitung is named Mark. Should have just pressed down instead of up to go cycle through those towns. Um, so yeah, basically I spent about three or four hours uh, between this episode, or last episode and this episode, uh, just training Pokemon and uh, training my team specifically. Uh, and there are like average like 51 to 54, um, which I don't even know if I'll be doing good. Some of these boss Pokemon are pretty, pretty crazy. Pause it. Mark. And uh, basically I, I was training other Pokemon so they evolved. Uh, some of them I got from my other game files. Uh, game saves anyways. Like my, my red cartridge and my yellow cartridge. Like I wasn't going to freaking train a... Dratini to become a Dragonair, to become a Dragonite, that's... He, he evolves level 55. Like, I just went and traded one. So, basically, I I went as fast as I kind of could while still training my team fairly well. I also did use Mega Kick on Snot Dog because it is way stronger than uh, Mega Punch. But it has kind of shitty evade, or uh, accuracy. The only thing I have left to do is some buy some stuff. We want some, uh... Oh. Um... Some Max Potions. Not too many. Ten's fine. This press is no... There we go. Revives are good. Uh, I've got enough super potions. I was hoping there were super potions here, but whatever. Whatever, if I die and whatnot, we'll just go back and buy more things. But let's save. Whew, alright, here we go. Actually, I should probably switch up my team here. Uh, Snot Dog. The front and ready. Oh, all right. Let's do this. The Elite Four. Whew. Room one, Lorelei. So there is water here, so you can like fish and surf. I'm not putting the friggin' Pokemon information on there. It's just silly. All right, let's do this. Welcome to Pokemon League. I am Lorelei of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. Ha ha ha! Are you ready? Let's hope so. Here we go, this is, this is it guys. We are at the end. So basically each of these fights are basically gym badge, uh, gym fights. They're very strong. All right, Dugong. So Lorelei's ice. Dugong, however, is water ice. So we're gonna use some thunder. Nice. And like Dugong, level 54. And that's like the weakest Pokemon this whole thing. Oh boy. Oh no, not Growl. Not Growl, he's making, oh my God. Poor, uh, poor Snotog is so little uses of, uh, of his abilities, but he's so strong, so let's hope this goes well. Like I said last episode, you can heal up in between fights, so that's always good. Got Cloyster here. Use... I'm just thinking if it's water and ice, or if it's just water, or sorry, just ice. So I know you can use, I can use, um... Fire Blast on a couple of these guys. No, never mind. That was the smart choice. Okay, good. Slow bro. Okay, Thunder again. I could use Slap Chop as well. Uh, Slap Chop has very powerful grass moves against these water Pokemon, but they could use ice abilities and just kick my ass. Oh, using a super, super potion, huh? Okay. Use my Thunder again. Ah, missed. Water Gun? Really? Wow. It's like nothing. 
Okay, I don't want too many misses, especially with Snot Dog. I don't have a lot of PP to spare. I do have a couple um, ethers I've been finding around the around the game. I've I've taken all my um my good items from the PC and kind of loaded myself. So let's hope this. I don't need too many items throughout it. Fire Blast. Okay, I don't know what Thrash does. Oh, very little. I'm okay with that. Night. Ah. Oh! I hate that. I'm like, oh, I don't want to use like a billion other things, you know what I mean? Frig. Fire Blast. Okay, yeah, I figured the Super Potion will be used. Come on, don't- mm, Stop missing! Doesn't matter how powerful I am, I find I'm always very butt-clenchy at the Elite Four. I mean, it's the final boss, right? Like, it's gonna be tough. Plus, that's nice levels. Levels in between these things. Lapras. Okay. Use another thunder. Come on, hit hard. Okay, it's not too bad. Don't paralyze, don't paralyze. Holy shit. That was a critical. Okay, didn't paralyze though. And I missed. Shit. Yeah, it's one down. Alright. Ugh. Wow, a lot of my guys are weak to um, to ice. He's toxic. Shit. Shit. Oh, thank God. Come on, toxic, go. Yes. That way, even if someone dies, Lapras will slowly die, basically, so. Oof, that's gonna be harsh. Yep. Oh my God. Yeah, Madrian doesn't even do that much. That's super effective. And... Oh, nice. Okay. I'm fine with that. Waste your super potions, man. I'm alright with that. This Toxic's just gonna take you out at that point. Nice. Alright. That is one down. Wow, 4,000 experience points. How dare you! So that I can inside joke at my work. <laughs> You're better than I thought. Go on ahead. You only got a taste of Pokemon League power. Well, that's one down. Let's heal up. Fight the second guy. Alright, all healed up. So here's Bruno, the shirtless man. I am Bruno of the Elite Four. Through rigorous training, people in Pokemon can become stronger. I've weight trained with my Pokemon. Phil, we will grind you down with our superior power. Hoo-ha! Alright, Bruno is a mostly about fighting type, but does have some rock type. I forget what he uses first. Please don't be an Onyx. Shit, because I am sending out Susan. That sucks. Switch out for Slop Chop. Uh, let's get Dingus out, actually. Get some Surf going. X Defend. That's fine, because that'll do Defend against... Like, that's de regular Defense. And I'm using something that I believe is um, uh, special. So it's not a physical attack. Okay, good. Perfect. All right. Yeah, we're fine. Bruno's probably the easiest of them all. Which is good. i use my... Susan. The only thing that can, can be scary about him and Chan, I don't, know if he, I don't know if he uses it, but he might have, like, Thunder Punch or something. But we're just gonna Drill Peck him. Two will probably... Oh, awesome. Cool. Hit on Lee, same thing. Just peck him. Good thing I don't even need Sky Attack, which takes two uh, two turns to actually do anything. So that's nice that I'm just able to kill him like this. Okay, another Onyx, which means let's get Dingus back out. Yeah, he's definitely the easiest of them. Surf. Yeah, look at that. A slam. Not not that much damage. I think it's because Dingus is pretty much a tank, so that's always nice. You're done. Okay, cool. I think we finally get to see Machamp here. Yes, Machamp. Okay, so this is the evolved form of Machop and Machoke. Machamp. Four-armed freak. But he's super powerful. Uh, 
Let's sky attack it. Charge up. Can't hit me, because that's a ground move. And smash. You've got to be dead. Yeah, there we go. That was an easy fight. I don't even need to heal. Didn't even get hit. Actually, I did, technically, but whatever. Why? How could I lose? I don't know, because you suck. You're the worst one here. My job is done. Go face your next challenge. By the way, if you lose and you have to start over, you do gain that experience and that, that money, so it's definitely not the worst thing in the world. It could be a lot worse. Um, Let's keep... I could put Beam Bean in there, because Beam Bean got psychic. Yeah, okay, let's put Beam Bean there. This is Agatha. The old lady. I am Agatha of the Elite Four. Oak's taken a lot of interest in you, child. That old duff was once tough and handsome. That was decades ago. Now he just wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's wrong. Pokemon are for fighting. Phil, I'll show you how a real trainer fights. So she is a ghost trainer, which is super interesting. And she can be sort of difficult, depending on what she does. She has like two Gengars, I think. Because there's only three ghost type of ones in the game. Ugh. Stronger than me, too. But hopefully, Psychic will take it down. Okay, that's not bad. Whew, good. Yeah, he probably has the uh, Hypnosis Dream Eater combo, which is super dangerous. Golbat, which is poison, so another Psychic should be fine. Yeah, so she... Like, most of the trainers here have, like, dual-type kind of things, so instead of, like, just Ghost, she has other things, and Poison is the other thing. Really? How'd that not kill you? Oh, well, friggin', yeah, sure, go for it. Yeah, she keeps Psychic again. There's no sense in taking chances and not just trying to kill them off as, as quickly as possible with powerful attacks. Haunter? Really a Haunter? It's just weird to me to have, um, a not-fully-evolved Pokémon for the Elite Four. You know what I mean? I, I get it would make sense, because that way it's not like, here's three friggin' uh, Gengars, but still. Yeah, we're gonna be using up all our Psychic for this fight, I think. Yeah, good. Down you go. Arbok. Alright, another, another poison Pokémon. It's going well. Consider how strong these guys are, like, oh my god, come on! Uh, take down. I can't afford to use another psychic. Oh, aww. Okay, screw it. Yeah. Just get it over with. And last one, I think, is another Gengar. Who I should be fine against as long as they don't use Hypnosis on me. It's level 60, jeez. Okay, I can still two hit him. Ooh, Toxic. Really? Yes. Okay, cool. Ooh, that's three of the four. I am nervous. I, I'll be honest, I'm nervous. And I know it seems like I'm winning really easily, and I'm, like, not having a hard time, but it's worrying, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a bunch of fights in a row. Oh-ho! You're something special, child. Money, 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 money. You win. I see what the old death sees in you now. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. Alright, let's save before we go in, because I think it might just drag me into the battle right away. Uh, what do I use against this guy? Alright, let's do this. The last of the Elite Four, Lance the Dragon Trainer. Okay, so I can move around. Okay, I wasn't sure if it, like, just propelled me into the fight or not. Ah, I heard about you, Phil. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokémon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. Well, are you ready to lose? Your league challenge ends with me, Phil. Here we go! Let's do this! If we're gonna die, it's gonna be here. Gyarados, perfect. Use a thunder, you're gone. Do I have a Thunder left? Thank god, okay, good. Hydro Pump, yeah, go for it. Wow, Gyarados is fast. Oof. Oh, of course I missed. Come on, dude. Now's not the time for the shit, Snot Dog. 
Come on, man. Hyper Potion, which means he's still going to use Hydro Pump to get another hit on me. Oh, Leer. Okay, good. That's fine. Ugh. Oh my god, and I've lost all my thunder. Thanks, Snot Dog. God. Let's use Ice Beam. Shit. Oh my god, this is not going well. Yeah, Snot Dog might be out of this. I don't know yet. Wow, that does very little. Well, let's waste an ether. I know he's going to elixir. What does the elixir do? I don't have any ethers? Are you serious? Oh, max ether. It's going to kill me, but I mean, I can... Oh, he has to recharge. Right, because it's friggin... Oh, it doesn't matter. Hydro Bomb is going to kill me anyways. Snot Dog's dead, but I can bring him back to life. And he'll at least have um, full thunder use. That was really disappointing. Shit. Toxic. Cool. Come on. Good. Okay. Max revive. There we go. I'll keep using the slap chops. See if I can do anything with them. The last thing I want to do is is take him out and then force Snot Dog to take a hit. Flying though, so it's not gonna do a lot of damage with um, grass Pokemon moves. Oh, whatever. You know what? Ow, Hyper Beam, freak. Uh, yep. Thanks, Snot Dog. This could have all been avoided if you had just hit him with one attack. Swear to God, this misses. Whoa, oh, frig. Yeah, I totally forgot. So this is a weird glitch. Normally, you're supposed to be able to. You have to charge Hyper Beam off, like, like, you have to... You have to recharge after Hyper Beam, but if it kills the enemy, you do not have to recharge. That was needlessly painful for everyone involved. Dragonair, okay. Um, there's gonna be dudes in there. Fisher even hit? From faster, maybe? Nope. I probably have to use like an X accuracy or something that's 40 right off the bat. Let's dig. You're faster now. Greatly rose crap. Well, that's not good. Now he's faster than me, okay. Okay, um, slash. Okay, another 40. At least I can predict how much Dragon Age will do against me, so it's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, good. Another Dragonair. Here's the... Here's the Revive. On Slop Chop. Missed. Good. Come on, critical. You're always good for critical, Slash. Yep, good. Okay. Um, drill Peck. Nice, okay, good. I just want to avoid getting hit as much as possible, because, I mean, like, if I use Sky Attack, it's, it's a full turn with me doing nothing. Aerodactyl. Um, Snot Dog. I might get killed by this, though, because he's faster than Snot Dog. I pretty much have to get um, Ice Beam off. Take down. Great. And gone. Yeah. Shit. Come on, Dingus. Try to get Blizzard going. Nine levels higher than me, too. Okay, that didn't do very much. Come on, stop missing! 
Oh my god, this is bullshit. Yeah, I'm fine. Keep using supersonic. I mean, <laughs> I'm already, I'm already confused, so it doesn't matter. Not, oh, so close. Let's use it again. He's probably gonna use a potion. No, he doesn't. Friggin' hyper beam, though. Mm. Oh, come on, hit. Yes. Okay, good. Oh. Last one, another Dragonite. Let's get Slap Chop in there. Toxic. Okay, Barry's fine. Ah, oh, shit. Wow, he's just increasing his defense like crazy. Good, okay, good. Oh! Have I accidentally abused the um, AI glitch? I think so. Let's explain this, shall we? Alright, so. The AI in Pokemon is not very good. It just isn't. Um, there's three types of um, AI. There's like regular wild Pokemon, there's trainer, and then there's gym AI. Uh, Lance, of course, is a gym AI because he's one of the more powerful types of enemies in the game. Now, the crazy thing is, uh, the AI for a gym leader means that if the gym leader has a move that is of a type that is superior to its enemy's type, um, then it will use it, no matter what. And Dragonite has Agility and Barrier, both of which are Psychic abilities, and both uh, will always be used against Slap Chop, because Slap Chop is poison. So no matter what, Dragonite will never attack me. So I've basically won this. Ah, damn, Hyper Potion. I still won this, but now I've just gotta wait a little bit longer. Oh man, that poison does way... Oh, damn. It does a lot of damage, though, as it goes on. Look at that. Look at all that poison damage. Basically, it means I've won, though. So hooray for me. Oh, that felt good. That felt good. So there we go. We beat the game. Or did we? I don't know. See you guys next time. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> I hate to admit it, but you are a Pokemon master. Thank you. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Phil. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge ahead. You have to face another trainer. His name is... Mandark! He beat the Elite Four before you. He is the real Pokemon League champion. Bastard. Well, with that, I am saving now, and I'm going to heal up, and that is it for today. Next episode, we will fight our old rival, Mandark, and become the Pokemon League champion. Take care, guys.